I'm not a big car fan, but this supercar caught my eye. The Bugatti La Voiture Noire, literally the black car, sold for 16.7 million euros, about 27 million Australian dollars, which is said to be a record price for a new car. Only one was produced, and the buyer remains anonymous. The car comes with a huge 1500 horsepower, 16 cylinder, 8 litre engine encased within a sleek jet black carbon fibre body. For the same price, you could buy approximately 850 Mitsubishi Tritons or 1700 Suzuki Swifts. Or, if you're into overpriced property, you could buy about 25 average priced houses in Sydney. Comparing the La Voiture Noire with those more affordable cars, a Suzuki Swift has a top speed of 194km per hour, a Triton 200km per hour, and the black car 420km per hour. Boy, that's fast. In terms of acceleration, from 0 to 100km per hour, the Suzuki takes 7.8 seconds, the Triton 10.55 seconds, and the black car 2.4 seconds. Storage space in the boot, the Swift has 265 litres, the Triton 1 tonne, and the black car 44 litres, which is only about the size of a medium backpack. And lastly, fuel consumption in litres per 100 kilometres. The Swift uses 6.1 litres per 100, the Triton 7.6, and the black car uses a whopping 35.2 litres per 100 kilometres. Man, in Australia you'd be just driving between petrol stations filling it up all the time. The La Voiture Noire was produced to celebrate the 110th anniversary of Bugatti. In their own words, a pioneering spirit passion for perfection and the desire to continually redefine its limits have been the key characteristics of Bugatti since it was founded 110 years ago. None of the brand's masterpieces reflect these values more impressively than the Type 57 SC Atlantic. Created by Ettore Bugatti's eldest son, Jean, the only four Atlantics ever created stand for pure elegance and sophistication, with its homage to the fourth all-black Atlantic, missing since the Second World War, Bugatti is bringing the speed, technology, luxury and aesthetics of an icon into a new era. But the customised creation of La Voiture Noire is far more than a modern interpretation of the ghost of the Gran Turismo. La Voiture Noire is a tribute to Bugatti's own history, a manifesto of the Bugatti aesthetic, and a piece of automotive haute couture. So which do you prefer? An overpriced La Voiture Noire, or 25 overpriced Sydney houses?